whichever is convenient to you. After drawing these imaginary generators, let me draw its top view. So to draw its top view, let me take projections from this front view, vertical lines from these points, vertical line from 1 and horizontal line from one, point 1, vertical line from point 1 dash and horizontal line from point 1. So here is one point, so that is point P1. Similarly, vertical line from point 2, like this. And horizontal line from point 2, here is point number 2, vertical line from point 3, like this, and horizontal line from point 3, here is point number 3, point number 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 points would be there by taking projections from each point. And join all these points with a smooth curve because it will appear as an ellipse the uh, base is circular and it's an inclined so it will appear as an ellipse like this so join all these points with a smooth curve if you do lots of practice you can easily draw with a smooth curve and apex point is here vertical line from point O dash horizontal line from point O join that apex point in such a way that they become tangent to this ellipse and draw its axis like this. This is the axis of this cone and name the views. This is front view and this is top view of given problem. Dimensions are given to us. It is slant. It is resting on its slant edge. So this is the solution of given problem. Write question number or answer number 3b with big letter on the <coughs> answer sheet because many times students forget to write this 3b. I hope the solution is clear to you. So <coughs> right now we stop our discussion over here. We will continue with the solution of more problems after few times. Thank you. Thanks to all.